Hey everyone, Video Game Lover here, and welcome to another pickup video. Doing it in this area instead of my usual spot, which is where my laptop is, is because my laptop is hooked up to my TV so I can watch My Hero Academia Mega Box. I've been watching a lot of anime right now to catch up. Reason being, I went to Charleston for a few days with the family and enjoy myself in the beach. So, got a couple pickups. Now, four of the five games I'm about to show you are pickups I actually got before I went to the beach. So, this is the only thing I picked up in Charleston. Um, I went to the game room. It's a retro video game store in Charleston. They have a lot of stuff. A lot of games. Like, holy gosh. There were a lot of games. But the problem with that store was it was very overpriced. Um, some may think it's reasonably priced, but there's some games that I don't think is worth. Like almost every game I saw was ten dollars. Even like the most common games were ten dollars. They actually had a Dragon Ball Z Game Boy. Keep in mind, it's not modded. It, it's a regular Game Boy, except it's it's in a custom shell. They were selling it for a hundred and sixty dollars. I literally saw modded Game Boys in a Southeast Game Exchange three years ago and they were selling for $100. I have no idea what that that's all about, but this was the only game I picked up, Ninja Assault. Now the game is inside my PS2, but it came complete. There you go, see? It came complete. Um, this is a pretty fun rail shooter for the PS2, and now I have... I believe I now have every rail shooter from Namco, which was Vampire Knight, Ninja Soul, and the three Time Crisis games. So, really nice to have this game. I paid 15 for this game, which I think that's a little overpriced, but very happy to have this game. So now, on to some thrift store finds. So, after I had that extreme drought, I've been actually finding some games in the thrift. Um, I don't know I'm going to find anything... Uh, tomorrow, so we'll, I'll share you that part if it happens. If not, I'm just going to upload it. So, I found two Wii games. Carnival Games. The game that, for some reason, sold over 4 million copies. And it's complete. I just got it based on this structure alone. I, I, me and my older brother, for some reason, we used to rent this game all the time. I don't know why. It's just a basic Carnival game, but for some reason, a lot of people really like this one, so... Picked that up. Speed Racer. I thought this was a cool find. I actually heard some good things about this game. Speed Racer, the game, um, it's complete. And but I heard that the PS2 version is a little bit better, so but nonetheless, I got it complete. And Xbox and on the Xbox, Sony Off Pro Scary 3. It's this only. I don't know this game works at all because there is a pretty rough scratch in it, but either way, kinda happy to have that. And now on to the last pickup. I paid a good bid for this. Um, I really wanted it back in my collection. I was gonna get it in the Southeast Game Exchange, but I decided, let me just get it now, because I saw this on uh, Facebook Marketplace and I decided to pick it up. Welcome back, my childhood. Super Smash Bros. Melee. It's missing the manual, but it has the game inside, and it works. So, very happy to have Melee back to my collection. Uh, I've always wanted this game. That's kind of funny how in the back it says the All-Star Brawl, which will be the next, the name of the next Smash Bros. game, but Melee, man. It's hard to believe this game's going to be 20 years old. So, very happy to have this game. So, yeah, that's uh, my pickups. Um, I will, I'm not going to upload this video yet until tomorrow, because I, I plan on going to the thrift tomorrow. So, we'll see if I find any more games. See you guys later. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Very game lover.